What are Steam levels and why should we level it up? The higher your Steam level, the more benefits you get on Steam. This includes more friends list slots, up to 14 profile showcases which you can use to make your Steam profile personalized, such as custom artwork showcases and more legit and reputable looking Steam account and much more. Alright, but you might be asking, how do I level up my Steam account then? So in this video I'm going to be going over the different ways to level up, whether that be manually using the Steam market, using third party services or without spending any money at all. You may have noticed a few items in your Steam inventory that look something like this. These are called trading cards, they are used to craft badges that earn you XP for your Steam account. To craft a badge you need to collect all the cards in the set. You can buy the cards via the Steam market, trade for them or buy sets in their entirety from third party vendors, which I'll be covering later in this video. Crafting a badge earns you 100 XP, and badges from the same game can be crafted up to 5 times, meaning you can earn 500 XP from one game alone. The cheapest card sets will usually set you back around 20 cents USD on the Steam market. You can use websites such as steam.tools to find the cheapest sets. These sets can be crafted from the badges homepage which is located on your Steam profile. But how many badges do you need to craft to go up a level? From levels 1 through 10 you only need one badge, or 100 XP per level. Meaning to get from level 1 to 10 you only need to craft 10 badges. This should probably cost you around $2 USD to get you to level 10, depending on which sets you're crafting. But as you climb the levels it costs more XP to level up. For every 10 levels the cost per level goes up by 100 XP. Meaning to level up from level 10 to 20 will cost you 2 badges or 200 XP rather than 1 badge. And this algorithm keeps going as you level up. But there are other ways to earn XP. First of all, you can get 500 XP from earning the Steam Community Badge by completing various tasks throughout the Steam Community that are listed within the badge. You also earn 50 XP per each year you have been on Steam. There are also events during the semi-annual sales where you can earn even more XP for participating in these events. Now I'm going to cover how to actually turn these cards into badges and how I'd personally go about using the manual process and the third party method. For the manual process, I recommend using a website called steam.tools to find the cheapest Steam cards to ensure you're getting the most bang for your buck. Once you have found the cheapest sets, you can now go to the Steam market and buy them from their individual pages. And then you can make your way to the badges section on your Steam profile, located here. Once we are in the badges homepage, we're going to click on the completed set and then click the big blue craft button in the top right. Watch the animation and then bam, you have 100 more XP and an emoticon slash background to use on your profile. This method works pretty well for going up one level at a time by if you're looking to get to a high level such as 50, I'd recommend this second method. The second method involves using a third party service such as Callus' Cardbot, which is what I'll be using to show you the process that I use to level up my Steam profile quickly. I'm going to be using my friend Hoof's account for this demonstration because it will better show you what experience you will have when leveling up from a low level. To use this Cardbot you need to have CSGO or TF2 keys, which you can buy in game or from websites like Bitskins. However this bot does not accept Hydra keys due to their unstable price and make sure you have your Steam Authenticator. So I'm going to walk you through how to use Callus' Cardboard. So the first thing you're going to need to do is click on the link to the description and send it an invite on Steam. It will add you back and then you can start using it. Type in exclamation mark help to get up all these useful commands. You can see I'm typing exclamation mark a level and then level 30 to see how many keys it will take for me to get from level 24 to level 30. And it says it'll cost me 1.4 keys. And now you can see I'm typing exclamation mark 5 which means I want to buy 5 keys worth of sets. The bot will process my transaction and send me a trade offer when it's ready. You can see I'm going to accept the trade offer and wait for the cards to come through. It might take a little while because there's so many cards, just be patient. Kalazar wanted me to remind you guys that you need to craft all of the sets that you were given before you order again, so make sure you do that to make sure you don't get any double ups. Now as you can see I've got all the cards in my inventory, so now I'm going to go to my badges page and start the crafting process all over again. You can see in the top right there is a craft 4x or 5x or how many sets you've got in that one game and you can click those to craft them all at one time which is a new feature and it speeds up the process so much more. Anyway so I'm going to craft all these sets for my friend Hoof. Now you can see my friend Hoof is level 42 on Steam and he's gotten a lot of the benefits that come from a higher Steam level. Like his profile looks more legit, he's got more friends list slots and more showcases on his profile including a really cool Sabuna group one that you should join. Anyway guys that's it for this video, sorry that I haven't uploaded in like close to a year, I don't think I'm going to be going back to that regular cycle of content. 
and if I do upload from now on, it will probably be things that aren't really so related to Steam artwork, just gaming in general. Anyway guys, thank you for watching this video, I hope to see you on my channel in the future, and have a nice day.